4th of July, it's impossible not to remember, remember, it's impossible not to remember why, when this nation was founded, Charlton Heston standing on the, on the sands of the Planet of the Apes when he realizes that that's the Statue of Liberty. I hope I'm not spoiling the end. But ladies and gentlemen, this is the portion of the show that we like to call the bonus track. It's the hidden song. It's the battle for the Planet of the Apes. Ladies and gentlemen, representing the apes on the bass, it's Dan. On the drums, it's Dan. Representing the people, it's John. And John, it's a battle, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see who wins. But wait, in a brilliant typecasting move, They Might Be Giants has put the audience in the role of the audience. You're getting the idea. When the, when the apes are playing, we want you to raise your left fist in the air and chant the word ape. We're outside, so we know it's just gonna sound like that weird, Weasley, Tusk, marching band, whatever that shit is. It's not gonna really sound like a rock crowd. But in, but in a move to make the audience actually seem double in size, we ask you to raise your right fist in the air and chant the word people while the people are playing. John and I are representing the people. Today, tomorrow, we'll be the apes again. So here we go, Battle for the Planet of the Apes. It's sort of, you know, it's just like that kind of fist thrusting, that, you know, that 80s stuff. All right, here we go, Battle for the Planet of the Apes. No matter what we do, John and I lose. We've tried apes, we've tried people. What is that?